Besides its long history, the Longhua Temple is the largest temple in Shanghai. It occupies an area of over 20,000 square meters. The whole courtyard was built strictly in the style of traditional Buddhist symmetry and it is accordant with the Chinese concept of beauty. One of the major events celebrated in this temple is the New Year Bell Striking Ceremony. A vulnerable copper bell which is about 2 meters in height, 1.3 meters in diameter and weighs about 5 tons, is placed in a 3-storied bell tower. The evening bell striking ceremony is on the 31st of December is regarded as one of the eight great attractions of Shanghai. Welcoming the new year in a melodious heavenly sound of the bell which is an extraordinary interesting and memorable experience. Chinese netizens will visit the temple on daily basis and pray to the Buddha God to ask for favor, to ask for riches, to ask for children, to ask for success in their businesses, and to ask for good health. After praying to the different gods moving through the different temple houses, they will then gather at the main courtyard with their incense burned, striking to their forehead three times and lifting it up 
to heavens, asking for favor, asking for riches, asking for abundant blessing. There is a famous saying which says, when you're in Rome, you should do what the Romans do. So I didn't want to be left out. I took my incense, light it up, and also followed suit with the print style. I don't want to be left out when the Chinese gods are blessing them. I don't want to be left out when the gods of wealth, when the gods of abundant health, abundant blessing are falling upon the Chinese people. So I followed suit, burned my incense and threw it So guys, I'm here at the Longhua Temple. You can see right, right behind there, right of the Longhua Temple. It's written in Chinese. Uh, I think in this temple, it's a little bit different from Jinan Temple because I think it's more set to compared to Jinan Temple. I think Jinan is really in the city center and with tall buildings everywhere. You can really you can't really see that ancient tradition you can't really see that ancient worship in it because it's like the city mixed with ancient tradition but here at uh, Longhua temple it's far a little bit far away from the city so it's more serene the atmosphere is really traditional and you can really experience that real chinese tradition here at the Longhua temple So guys, thank you so much for watching our video. That was it for our visit to the Longhua Temple. If you like our video guys, don't forget to subscribe because on this channel, we don't only share videos like this, we share videos on entrepreneurship, business development and social motivation. And because we are in China, we want to show the world to China, we want to tell the world what Chinese people are made of. And that's why from time to time we do videos like this sharing our experience in China and showing the world, taking the world, taking China to the world. So if you like this video, please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Comment, let me know what you think about this video in the comment section below. And if you have not yet subscribed to our channel, please don't forget to hit that red subscription button. Join our channel so that each time we upload interesting videos like this, you will be the first to be notified. Until now, watch to the end of the video while I leave you to this last temple house at Longhua Temple. I'll see you. Bye-bye. Sai -bye. Jen.